Welcome back to the weekly update. This is the update for November 3rd, 2023. It's uh, version 1.9.16 hotfix and update review. And the first screenshot is by Isaiah the Ace. Dear Stormworkers, today we are releasing a hotfix with some improvements in response to player feedback. This is the fifth such update this week as our focus has been improving the balance of the fluid system for the best compatibility with existing creations. Check below for patch notes and check the news feed for info on dozens of other fixes we have released this week. This is part of our plan to improve the fluid system performance for old creations. Let's talk more about where this started and where it is heading. The situation. It's time for some RP. Imagine that you're a Stormark developer and the Space DLC released about 24 hours ago. The Space update negatively impacted many existing player creations. This is Stormworks. Many of these creations took hundreds of hours to make. This is a huge deal. Firstly and most obviously, some ships, particularly large ships, computed their mass slightly differently, which meant they might set differently in the water. Fortunately, this was just one line of code update and you've already fixed it. Secondly, it turns out that you didn't test the new compressed gas fluid system on enough workshop creations. A lot of steam-powered vehicles, water jets, and some others didn't behave the same with the new fluid system. You had been working hard on our quality processes over the last couple of years, so to make such a mistake is really disappointing and so avoidable. While you did discuss the fluid system rework and potential impact of players, there's the link, long before this update, it was the intention that creations generally continue to work. This impact is far greater than you intended, and too many player creations are impacted. The space DLC is now live, and it depends on these fluid changes. And the space portion of this update is well tested and working. In the past, you may roll back a change, but in this case, with most of your players currently in orbit, that would make the situation much worse. The, pair, pl the player backlash is gaining momentum to the point where players are getting involved who have not played the update or are unaffected. Discord is out of control. There are at least a dozen people posting threats in your actual location. They are probably just kids, right? The last time you checked, there were 500 negative Steam reviews. You decided not to look again. It isn't helping. You're feeling the pressure. A new email it's from a YouTuber. Sorry to hear the backlash, Reed. Just keep doing what you're doing, and things will work themselves out. What a kind message to receive. It is good advice. And the next screenshot is by Red Pug. The solution. I think that in life, these stressful times come along once in a while, and for some people, the situation can be much worse than this. How you respond to the situation matters a great deal. You cannot change what is done, so you must look ahead for the best path forward. You need a clear head to see the best solution, and you can't allow the pressure to affect you. For us, it's about pressing on with development, reading player feedback, understanding the problem, and working through it in a pragmatic way. The next screenshot is by Alkali. This is what we've been doing. The game is in a much improved place, thanks to player feedback and the dozens of changes we have released. We have made huge progress on reworking the fluid system, working with players directly on experimental branch, hot fixing issues, and the new unit test system is in development so that we can record metrics on vehicle behavior and compare each game version. Learning involves making these changes to avoid the same issue in the future. We are now in year seven of live Stormers development with years to get to come and the exciting times ahead. Much love, Stormworks developers. Patch notes for the hotfix. Rework diesel burner now works much better due to changes to airflow, exhaust, diesel flow. Rework fluid labels now show pressure in atmosphere rather than storage to better explain pressure-driven system. Increase max effective pressure delta from 10 to 20 atmospheres. Rework fluid resolves slightly differently at low pressure to improve flow at low pressure. Fix water jets no longer produce force from negative RPS. And thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.